Forbidden Love Unveiled, Princess Anne's Secret Scottish Wedding with Sir Timothy Lawrence Revealed. As Princess Anne and Sir Timothy Lawrence celebrate the 31st wedding anniversary, they reflect on their special day, filled with love and secrecy. The Princess Royal and the retired Navy officer first crossed paths on the Royal Yacht Britannia, and their romance blossomed over the years. However, when it came time to exchange vows in 1992, they faced a forbidden love in England, leading them to travel to Scotland to tie the knot. Welcome to today's update. To be the first to be updated about trending records and vibes, subscribe now and comment later to inspire us make videos like this for you. Princess Anne had previously been married to Mark Phillips in 1973, and the divorce was finalized earlier that year. Yet, the Church of England did not permit remarriage, leaving Scotland as the only option for their union. Opting for an intimate celebration with only 30 guests, the couple said their vows at Crathy Kirk Church, the family's preferred choice of worship while staying at the Balmoral Estate. The guest list included the late Queen Mother, the late Queen, the late Duke of Edinburgh, Princess Anne's children Zara Tyndall and Peter Phillips, as well as her brothers, the then Prince of Wales, Prince Andrew, and Prince Edward. Official photographs captured the joyous moments shared with her closest family members. In a departure from tradition, Princess Anne chose a high-neck midi dress paired with a white jacket, exuding effortless chic. Completing her look with black court shoes and her signature beehive hairstyle, she radiated elegance. The wedding took place on a winter's day, December 12, 1992, after Timothy proposed with a stunning cabochon sapphire and diamond ring, symbolizing their everlasting love. As the newlyweds emerged from the church, the enchanting sound of traditional bagpipes filled the Scottish air. Princess Anne held a small posy of heather, matching the sprig of flowers adorning her hair. The heather, known for symbolizing good luck, added an auspicious touch to their special day, drawing well wishes from the crowds that had gathered to witness the quiet royal affair. Since their wedding, Princess Anne and Sir Timothy have shared a life together on the Gatcombe Park estate in Gloucestershire. Their daughter Zara resides there with her husband Mike Tyndall and the three children, while Peter, Princess Anne's son, is believed to live in a separate property on the grounds following his separation from his ex-wife Autumn Phillips in 2021. Peter has found love with longtime friend Lindsay Stephen in recent years. As the upcoming festive season approaches, Princess Anne and Sir Timothy spread joy by sending out their annual Christmas card, extending warm wishes to various charities and patronages. The Reliant Motor Club shared photos of the card, featuring a printed message that reads, with best wishes.